We've got Conference USA action just around the corner. Everybody's loose, everybody ready to hit. That's gonna wrap it up here in the studio, but we'll be here to keep you up to date on everything else going on in college football throughout our game. But it's time for ESPN's College Football, Fred Nessler and Kirk Herbstreet on the call. What's going on, guys? Charles Mustafa here with my UTEP Miners Dynasty. Last time we played, we were playing in Houston, and if you watched it all the way through, you'd see that we played them tough, played them tough, and then, you know, it just seemed like their defense just cracked hard down on my offense, and nothing seemed to work, so I just kind of threw deep the entire second half, like almost every play I threw deep. It wasn't the smartest I've ever played, but it was definitely kind of fun for me to do, but you can definitely tell there was a frustration level just in watching the gameplay. So, but this week, we're back. We're 2-6. and six. This is our last shot at becoming bowl eligible. If we lose, I mean, we lose this game, we're done. It's against a tough team. We're taking on UCF today. And, you know, they're a tough team on this game. They're, you know, in real life, too, they're generally, they generally have a pretty, fairly tough team. So we definitely have to come out and play today if we're going to hang with them. Because, you know, these guys, you know, they're probably at the top of the list of the CUSA in the lead. You know, they're one of the better teams in the conference. So we got to come ready to play. We need a big game from that man in the middle of that huddle, Nick LeMace. We need a big game from him. That's for sure if we're going to take, if we have any shot at winning this game. All right, we got the ball second after UCF went downfield and scored. And Jeffrey taking the handoff and getting some major yardage there. Picking up the first down. On first down again to Jeffrey. Jeffrey's picking. Oh, he's breaking a tackle. Jeffrey. Oh, he gets chased down inside the 15-yard line. I thought he was gone. All right, first down and 10 from inside the 15-yard line. We're definitely driving. I like this. LeMason throwing it. Rolling out. Perry drops it. Drops it. That's all right, though. Second down and 10. All right, dropping back. We're looking. We got a score on the... Oh, sad. For Pete's sake. Come on, guys. Third down and 16. No, it'd be great to get a touchdown here. LeMason scrambling. We're not going to get it. We're going to get fairly close, though. We're inside the five-yard line, picking up the field goal. And defense came up with a stop, got us the ball back. Jeffrey on the handoff, breaking another tackle, picking up nine yards. And after one, we're all tied up at three. That's right. We are in this game still. That's surprising. That's all right. All right. All right. Second quarter. we got to come out the same intensity and play a little bit better, even if you, you know, we got to keep going. All right, second and inches now. Hand it off to Jeffrey. Jeffrey's picking up the first down, running like a beast. This is what I've wanted to see out of Jeffrey. This is why he's my starting running back. First and ten, rolling out. LeMason, he's picking up some big yardage. And he's going to pick up the first down also. Here we go, no huddle. First and ten, dropping back. We're going deep. There's a man. We're under pressure. We're going to scramble. Oh, Tom was an open flag down, though. Generally, that's holding. More than likely, that's what it is. But what personal roughing the passer? Nah, nice. That's what I'm talking about. First and goal after the penalty and the long, long play. But heard and brought. I don't know his first name, but Megger. I want to say Brian. I'm not sure though. Jeffrey taking the handoff, getting in the end zone for the touchdown, and all of a sudden, we're ahead. Team loves it. Defense loves it. You know they went out, got a stop. We got the ball back halfway through the second quarter. Still picking up one yard. There is Jeffrey. LeMason back in from his little injury. He's probably fine. Jeffrey picking up five there. Third down and four. I like this. I can ground and pound all day long against these guys. LeMason underneath. We got Wenrick picking up the first down. Look at that. Let's get some strategy points down there. That's what I'm talking about. All right, first and ten. Got to drop back. I like this play. Look at it sacked. Only a loss of five, but that's his second sack of the day. Come on, man. Come on, that's that's one of my linemen just letting it through every time. Tomlinson there dropping the pass. Dropping it. All right, third down, 15. We're going the same play. That play you know, generally works fairly well, and it's just not open. It's just not open getting sacked. UCF would score. We're tied up at 10 with under a minute left in the second in the second quarter. Second down and five. Dropping back is Nick. Throwing it out. Overthrowing Jeffrey on the screen. All right, third down and five. This is big. This is big. We don't want we don't want UCF to get the ball right before half ends, because usually they score, and then they get the ball back and score. But that, their defense came up big for them, and our defense came up big and stopped them right out the clock. We got the ball back after the after half time. First play of the half, we're throwing deep. It doesn't matter that we got the ball first. Just throwing an interception, and the look at this return. It was basically just a punt, so they have excellent field position. Darn. 
All right, they scored. Surprise! That surprises no one really. We're down 17 to 10. Second down to 10, and at this point in the game, I had to stop myself from throwing deep every play almost. You know, I didn't want to have a repeat of the Houston game where we were in that game and we were actually leading, and then I just kind of lost my cool playing it and just threw deep every play. But you see there, Leslie dropping it on third down and 10. We're going to have to punt that one away. All right. UCF has a 14-point game, and we're dropping back. We want to go deep, and we might have a guy, and we do. It's Freytag coming up with the deep one. Picking up the first down, dropping back, we got Freytag again, who drops it. Come on, bro, you just made the biggest catch of the game, and you're going to drop that one? to be even bigger. Whatever, though. Jeffrey picking up nine yards, nice little run there. He likes to run hard for me. He plays hard all the time. A little spin moving. Ooh, fumble. Get on that. Darn it. Darn it. Are you kidding me? All right, got to start all over from back in our own territory. Jeffrey, another spin move in the backfield. Picking up eight yards. We're still down 14 with 35 left in the third quarter. All right, second down and two. Dropping back. We might have a man. We got Freytag on the post route. Freytag is getting down to the 25-yard line. Yeah, man. Yes. All right, first and ten. Rolling out. We are looking. LeMason under pressure and getting sacked. Second down and 19. Last play of the third quarter, and we're going deep, and we got a man. Oh, I threw I threw to the wrong guy. Man, that would have been a, that would have been a touchdown right there. Leslie had Leslie was wide open for that touchdown. I hit Frey tag though. That doesn't matter. We're down 24 to 10 going into the fourth quarter. We're still in this, I guess. We're two scores, but what's first and goal? We can make this a one touchdown ball game, and possibly win this. We got Dowell in. If you didn't watch my last video, at some point in my last video, Bell was injured. So this is Dow, our third stringer. He's not, you know, he runs hard, I guess, but he's not the best that I've seen. All right, third down and goal. We got to pick up this touchdown. We're going end zone. We got Tomlinson in for the touchdown, making this a seven-point ball game. UCF went and kicked a field goal. It's now a ten-point ball game. We got 2:40 left in the ball game. Dropping back, got sacked. Second down and nine. All right, dropping back again. Looking, we might have a man. We're going deep, and it's Leslie. Leslie, what are you doing? Dropping that? Are you serious? You can't do that. You can't do that to me. Third and 19, we went deep. Incomplete. Fourth down and 19, we punt. UCF went and kicked the field goal. 30 to 17. Dropping back. We're throwing it deep. We got less than a minute. And Leslie comes up with a big catch after he had that big drop. But that doesn't quite make up for a touchdown. Doesn't quite make up for the touchdown he would have had. Anyway, dropping back, getting sacked again. We have no timeouts. Clock is ticking, 25 seconds with second down and 16. But we've got a man streaking, and we've got Freytag. End zone, touchdown. Only a six-point ball game. All-side kick here. If we get this, we can win the ball game. And he's kick it straight to the UCF guy. Darn it. All right, guys. You see UCF picks up the win, but we played them extremely tough. That's the kind of game I like to see out of my minor team right now. We're right there. We're not eligible anymore, but we can sure go out and ruin some team seasons. Play the game here, the interception. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time, guys.